is uh, for breakfast and for lunch, um, for school and for work. Because let's face it, food is expensive. I seriously went to the grocery store the other day and was thinking about buying a gallon of milk and I didn't because I looked at the price and it was almost $4. And I was like, oh no, mm -mm, not happening. So that's what I'm gonna be showing you today because you know, you wanna save your money. Spring break's coming up, summer break's coming up and you wanna buy some cute outfits and some cute clothes and go somewhere nice. So save your money and let's get something really yummy to eat at the same time. So let's get into this video. So the first thing we're gonna be making is the strawberry banana smoothie. All you're gonna need is some bananas, some fresh cut strawberries, some frozen strawberries if you want, and honey, yogurt, and almond milk. You're gonna take your blender, I have a personal blender, and you're just gonna fill that up with your fruit. Um, I put in strawberries, bananas, and I'm gonna throw in a little bit of frozen strawberries to make it a little icy. Next, you're gonna add in your almond milk. And then after you add in your almond milk, you're just gonna put in your desired amount of yogurt. I really didn't measure anything out. I just put it as much as I felt like the smoothie needed. So if you have measurements, that's cool. But if you don't, then that's cool too. And then I made my little bear do a honey dance and I'm going to put in my sweetener, which is honey. Oh my gosh, it was so hard doing this with one hand. But after you're done, this is your finished product. A yummy strawberry and banana smoothie. So for the strawberry parfait, all you're gonna need is strawberries, granola, and yogurt. It's really simple. <laughs> You're gonna place your desired whatever you wanna put in first. I put in strawberries first, and then I layered it with granola, and then I put more granola, and then I put yogurt on top. And you just keep repeating the steps until you get to the top. Then after you're done adding your last few layers, it's gonna look like this. Wait, I mean like this. <laughs> and it's so yummy, you guys. I mean like I could not put it down. All right, to make your bagel pizza, all you're gonna need is bagel, which you're gonna cut in half. You're gonna need a tomato sauce, or any other sauce you like, um, oregano or any other spices, and I use mozzarella cheese. So the first thing you're gonna do is basically just spread your sauce all over your bagels. Once your bagels are completely covered in sauce, you're just gonna sprinkle on any of the seasonings you choose, and then you're just gonna lay your shredded cheese or your cheese on top of it. Then you're gonna place it on your oven bake pan. I put foil on mine so it's an easy cleanup. And then you're just gonna pop those into the oven. All right guys, so to make your fruity oatmeal, um, I just got some diced, uh, no added sugar peaches and some oatmeal. And then you know how to make oatmeal. And I just pushed out all the liquid to my peaches and then I just mix those two together and bam, you have an instant meal. Yeah. So the last meal is a turkey bagel sandwich. All you need is some sliced turkey, bagels, a cheese of your choosing, I chose mozzarella, and then some condiment, condiments. And I chose mustard, because I love mustard a lot. And then you just put your meat on, and you don't have to make it a turkey, you can make it a ham, you can make it a roast beef, whatever you want. And I just put my cheese on, and does anybody else put their cheese on like opposite directions? Because I do. And then there you go, there's your sandwich. And it's easy for you to take it on the go, it's so yummy. Alright guys, so I really hope you guys liked this video. I'll tell you with my struggles, 
I discovered granola like two weeks ago, and now I'm addicted. It's so sad. I'm addicted. Granola. Anyways, if you did like this video, then totally let me know by pressing the thumbs up like button so that I know that I should make more videos like this. And if you have any other suggestions or comments, you can put that down in the comment section somewhere down here in this general area <laughs> below. And I will totally try my hardest to respond to you. Usually it's on the weekends because I work full time. So, oh, I don't know why I just clapped that loud. So sorry. Um, I did it again. Okay, whatever, Brandon. Just keep on clapping. Um, but yeah. And so I was totally trying to respond back to you guys as soon as possible, but most of the time it's on the weekends because I work a full-time job. But yeah, I really hope you guys like this video and I really hope it motivates you to make your own lunches and breakfast and meals, period. And yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the end of this video. I don't have anything else. Love you guys and I will see you guys soon.